Llamas are like rats in Minecraft. They just spawn everywhere and they're impossible to get rid of. Okay, so, hi, this is my thinking area. So, since I've last been recording, I, uh, I've done some mining, and let's take a look and see what my spoils are, because I did get some diamonds, I have nine to start with. And I got nine ore, so I'm hoping that that gives me the the 24 I need to make diamond armor. This is what happens when I get bored and I'm in between projects. So let's clean this up first. Okay, so let's go take a look at our stuff. I have it all stashed in here. So we got nine diamond blocks, 51 gold blocks, three lapis, which will probably give me like nine stacks. A uh, stack and a half of iron. Over three stacks of redstone and almost four stacks of coal. So let's start with the coal because why not Okay, so that's what we ended up with. So we got almost an entire chest full of redstone. We got a whole row full of coal. Got a, over a stack of lapis. That was from, what, three blocks? Lapis is nuts. So I got the stack and a half of iron, almost a stack of gold, and here's the important one. 21 diamonds. That's not bad. So let's go try to put this away. And then we need to make some armor. So now... Alright. And we will put the diamonds all the way up there. Okay. And actually, do I have any emeralds? Yeah, but I'll hold off on that. Oh, torches. I realize I had some stashed in here. Okay, so multi shot doesn't help us. Riptide doesn't do anything. Sharpness doesn't do anything. Sharpness does it. Projectile protection will just grab for the heck of it. And loyalty doesn't help us. Okay, so I don't really have a whole lot of stuff ready to go. But in the meantime, we're just going to stash this stuff over here. Now, before I go and start doing some farming, because I'm going to have to show you what is finished. So this, finish this while ago and it is producing quite nicely if I do acknowledge uh, feathers I believe you can actually sell to a Fletcher so we just have to you know make sure there's a Fletcher in the village the nano farm works 
this thing regrows like crazy, but when it's only five blocks high, that will happen. And then we've got our smelter area. So that's good. And I still not 100% sure spacing wise, but what's going to happen in here is I'm going to do, and I had said I wasn't going to, but then I changed my mind. I'm going to do a small auto bamboo farm and a small auto uh, sugarcane farm. And I might end over here with an auto cactus farm, but I have to keep an eye on spacing. So... And that'll do, those will be the automated farms. And then let's take a look at what I've been up to in the meantime. Alright, so let's do a little farming so we can do a little trading. projectile protection book either but whatever all right let's see what we get I doubt I'll need more than that yet probably gonna need some of these all right depth strider 2 feather falling 4 respiration 2 respiration 2 aqua infinity projectile protection don't care about more than that. And these are all the and then feather falling 4 I have two feather falling 4 books Oh, I'll have to put one of them back over there. Alright. So, we're good as long... Okay. If this guy gets some of the XP back that I'm going to spend if I get something crappy like thorns. So. 
All right, so what do we got? Where are we at? All right, projectile protection for. All right, let's let's start with these guys. Oh, actually, let me double check. I know I looked at these earlier, and then I completely forgot. All right, thorns, you can just go do something. And then these are yeah, those are usually the same. All right, the pants and the uh, chest plate are almost always the same. Nice. All right. Happy with that. Uh, fire protection is not too bad. I was hoping that it would give me something that I could see. Like a, like Aqua Infinity or something on there. Speaking of thorns... Bye. Alright. I'm going to need more levels, but... Alright, protection three, fine, whatever. What do we got here? Unbreaking three, oof. That might be a little too tough to pass up, because I can get the other stuff I need. Alright. Mm, we'll go feet. And just unbreaking, okay. Respiration. Cool. And then what are we going to end up with there? Projectile protection. That's fine. So I could get the other protections later. This one, I just need mending. This one I need to put Aqua Infinity on. So let's... That doesn't happen here. All right. So, I do have an Aqua Infinity book in here. Alright. I'm breaking. What is it? What's it going to do to me to put Depth Strider on there? Oh, not too bad. Or, I mean, Feather Falling. And then I have to up Depth Strider. But I just have the one. Okay. Well, that is good for now. Okay, well, that'll do it for me. Because I've pretty much done everything I need to do for now. Uh, I'm going to be doing some stuff off camera. Like probably putting another layer on my base. And then the next big project will be the two farms once I figure that out. But I may hold off on those because we've been talking iron farm. So we'll see how that goes. So I will catch you next time.